guys, so today I'm telling you a really embarrassing story about something that happened to me while I was in elementary school in, I think, grade one, that I still haven't lived down to this day. It's just about one of the most embarrassing moments of my whole existence and life. So I figured, hey, why don't I tell it to the whole entire internet? That's, that's such a great idea. So in grade one, I think it was about halfway through the year, I didn't really have any friends because that was at the point where the guys started not liking me because I was a tomboy and the girls didn't really just want to talk to me because I was really weird and I was the girl who dressed like a guy. Yeah, I was that kind of kid. Basically, there was a time in class where I was sitting down and my teacher, she wouldn't let me go to the bathroom and I was the kind of kid that always had to go to the bathroom. I think I had to go to the bathroom like every half an hour. And my teacher just got fed up with it and this one time said no. And I was crying and I was telling her, I have to go to the bathroom, let me go pee, please. And I was begging, but she wouldn't let me go because she figured, oh, she's just faking it, you know. She does this all the time, she always has to go to the bathroom. She obviously doesn't have to actually pee. So that was a stupid idea for her. Um, so my teacher, um, once she said no, I just kind of sat in class and I was staring at the walls just trying to hold it in as long as I possibly could and I got to the point where by the way I, I was a very good student I didn't do anything wrong ever so this is horrifying I literally ran out of the classroom my teacher had no idea what I was doing and she didn't even really care I ran to the out of the classroom I went to the bathroom and by that time I was so like filled with pee <laughs> oh god I literally peed on the floor before I could actually sit down on the toilet and my pee was all over the floor and it was just everywhere and it was disgusting and we had about four stalls in our bathrooms at that time and some girl that I still know to this day she walked in and she saw what was on the floor and she didn't exactly know what it was and she was in the same grade as me or no she was a year younger yeah she was still in kindergarten and she looks at the floor and she says, Ew! What is that? Is that pee? Oh my god, what are you doing? And I, like, you couldn't see my legs because I decided to stand up on the toilet so no one could see what I was doing or to see what I had done. I wasn't still peeing, obviously. Um, so she's looking at it. And I had no idea what to do. My mind was just contained with, oh my god, everyone's going to hate me. Everyone's going to think I'm disgusting. They're all just going to remind me of the day I peed on the floor for the rest of my life. How am I going to live like this? So I kind of just got really scared. And stupid little Katie, oh, I literally yelled and I said, oh my god, ew, it's apple juice. That's disgusting. Oh, why did I do that? That was the stupidest idea ever. She literally believed me though, so that was the horrible part. And she asked, where did all the apple juice come from? So I told her that I didn't do it, and I was scared, and I made my way into the stall, and the apple juice got there. We were in grade one in kindergarten, so she believed me. Like, people believed me that I was magical because I thought I was, like, in a Yu-Gi-Oh tribe because I was obsessed with Yu-Gi-Oh. So, our little imaginative minds thought that somebody left apple juice all over the floor and we don't know who it was. What I did is that before I went to the office, I had to run outside and I was wearing a dress. It was kind of like a little, little kid dress, you know what I mean? Kind of like down to my knees. So I had to hold it down because it was a breezy day. It was in the summer, and I wasn't wearing any underwear, so because they were soaked, you know. And I had to run outside and tell my teacher, I'm going to the office. Why? And I went to the office, and I told them what I had done, but they never told my teacher. So my mom was called, and she brought me um, a pair of underwear. So my teacher talks to the whole class, about how there was apple juice in the girls' bathroom. And all the girls had to sit there and wait till someone confessed to it. Oh, good job, Katie. Just, why?
Why did I do that? Oh, my God. But yeah, at that point, I was literally sitting there, like, pretty much shitting myself, and I'm Oh my god, someone's gonna find out I did it. Someone's gonna know I peed on the floor. Oh my god, how, 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 why? So, yeah, that was really embarrassing. Why, Katie? Why did you do this?